So, let us compare the Intel Celeron N3050 with N2840. The N2840 as I make this video is uh, is the processor that is used in two of the HP's laptop available in Walmart's uh, 2015 Black Friday sale and let us see how this uh, this one compares with N3050. Uh, basically both of them are in the Bay Trail line of processor which is different from the Intel's regular line of processor which uh, makes up its uh, Core i3, i5 and so on and so forth. The latest series is the Skylake processor, but this uh, architecture of the Bay Trail and Braswell processor is different in its much inferior in performance, uh, more uh, tailored towards the low power uh, performance and you can see this TDP rating at 6 watts and 7.5 watt. Uh, power which is basically f uh, suitable for uh, a low power thin laptop which does not include potentially a uh, fan. So, uh, N2840 is clocked uh, substantially higher at 2.16 gigahertz and their burst frequency is of 2840 is also much higher and even though it is a slightly older processor launched in third quarter 2014 versus first quarter of 2015, it is still uh, substantially faster. You can see in the past mark we have a benchmark score, a popular past uh, mark, it is a popular benchmark score and 3050 is 743 and, uh, and 2840-1063 and both of them are substantially slower than Intel's like Core i3 series processor. Uh, and even their entry level processors are also have a pass mark score of at least something like 2000 and something like that. So, once, unless you are price constrained and their price is 107 dollars it's not substantially cheaper not like under 50 dollars processor. So, unless you are price uh, very tight in budget I would go for something like Intel so regular core i3 processors and something like that. But hope that this comparison helps you. Thanks for taking a look.